Ja, Filmfestival van Gent, gisteren een geweldige uh, film gezien, Sound of Noise. En daar zijn deze twee heren verantwoordelijk voor. Hi guys. Hello. Um, Hi. I just was, was telling uh, people at home, I saw Sound of Noise yesterday evening and I had a blast. It was really um, a topic you, yeah, well, it's, it's so unpredictable what you guys have done. Yeah, I'm glad to hear that. It's, um, that was one, one of our goals. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a special movie. It's kind of sound terrorism. Can we call it that? Sure. How how yes. would you how would you describe uh, the film? Yeah, the film. Our yeah. film. Yeah. We have one good sentence that we can give you. Uh, it's uh, that this is a film about uh, love, lunacy, and loud drumming. Yeah. A lot of L's. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds very good. Yeah. And it's yeah, it's it's a it's a film about loud drumming because you have six drummers who uh, who just yeah they commit crimes without them really being crimes. It's like yeah, it's 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 a crime movie without be, there being. It's not like in, in, in the bank scene that they they steal, okay they destroy money but they don't steal money. So mm -hmm. um, well, their their main purpose. Uh, of course to make music yeah that I don't I do. don't think that think that they consider themselves as criminals no. at all they no. are artists yeah and it's they really the, the, need to do their art the music the, the, the money that is shredded in under the concert is rather casualties of music I would say casualties of music yes. that's a nice way to put it yeah um, yeah because it's it's um, it's like um, street artists like Banksy and whatever but with music Yes. So, have you seen the Banksy film, by the way? Because it was no, here no, at the festival as well. No, and, uh, I I'm curious. Yeah, it's a it's a really good documentary. It's not not about Banksy himself, but about another street artist. But the film, your film, kind of reminded me of that because it's it's a new way to explore this kind of freedom of art concept. Um, mm. Yeah. How did you? Where did you get get the idea to do this? Well, they. they who knows where ideas come from originally, but yeah. we did make a short film uh, a few years ago called Music for One Apartment and Six Drummers. And, 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 and that's where we first uh, tried this concept of making music uh, out of ordinary objects rather than instruments. Yeah. And also putting it in, in, into a visual context. So um, and and when we did that short film, we really thought that that no, this this is a really narrow field that will certainly not interest a wide audience. But it yeah. turned out to be the, the opposite, yeah. which was very fun and, and surprising. But also we, when when that film the short started to to get popular, people also asked us to to come and perform and make music live. So we did that. A little, yeah. yeah. And and um, as we did that more and more ideas uh, came to us regarding this uh, concept of, of music and, and we just had to follow up uh, and, and see if we could make this into a longer uh, project. Yeah. You are a musician yourself, you are not. I, I got it from the yes. Q&A uh, last night. What do you play? Drum? Or no, I don't play the drums. No. I'm a bass player. You're a bass player. Yes, yeah. and uh, I'm a singer too. Okay. Um, but uh, no, not a drummer. Um, I can play when nobody is here. Yeah. Drums. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, that, that, that's one of the surreal elements that when people are touched or drummed on or whatever, they just can't hear stuff anymore. Mm -hmm. um, it's like that. It's kind of a psychological thing as well. How how many layers do you think your film has, and how many are intended? <laughs> I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, I, I think for for me personally, I'm I'm very happy if people can go and see it and just have 90 minutes of pure inter entertainment. Yeah. But of course, uh, we've been working with this for many years now, and and uh, uh, there are of course lots of things to find if you want, but it's not necessary to, to dig too deep. Mm. Um, when it comes to, to Vonobing, the policeman, uh, he, he, he of course, he's, he suffers from, from uh, um, being uh, uh, not an outcast, but he, he doesn't fit in in his family. He grew up in a 
family of famous musicians and he couldn't play a note himself. He was completely tone deaf from birth. And that, of course, is, is uh, uh, that situation can be applied to a lot of things and a lot of people. Uh, it doesn't have to concern music. Yeah. So I think, in a way, um, yeah, there are ways to identify yourself with, with this main character, Wannabe. Yeah, yeah, really, really well. Um, could you say that he has a basis in reality? Does he have personality traits from one of you guys, or is, would that be too far uh, gone? I don't know, but but uh, you often get tired of all the music you hear mm -hmm. in cities. It's, yeah. it's uh, always sounds, and always music when you uh, walk around in a city like this, even here. Yeah, even it's here. It's music yeah. for our <laughs> listening pleasure. <laughs> well. <It's just> <laughs> Silence is very exclusive now. Yeah. So in, in that in that sense, I I agree totally with with uh, our hero. Yeah. But um, for me, I I love music, so maybe that's why I would like to uh, n not hear it every every second of my uh, during the day. Yeah. I think it, it's it's also that you kind of appreciate music more if there's the silence as well. Yes, of course. Yeah. Because yeah. If, if there's this whole stream of music and sounds and mm. then it, it doesn't, well, it, it, it's not that special anymore. No. I also have this idea of trying to activate the, the ears of, of ourselves and yeah. people around us to, to listen more, more actively uh, to the sounds that uh, surround us and, and not only music but also the ambience. And yeah. All the details around us. So yeah. I have become a more active listener myself. I must say, yeah. after this project, yeah. for good and for bad. How much time did you put in the sound design? Because the film is full of sound. A lot, a lot of time. Yeah. Yes, we spend a lot of time in in the mixing room, and before that, um, uh, we spend also a lot of time just trying to get the perfect sound design. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of scenes obviously don't work if mm -hmm. you don't have the right sounds and um, I, I think we got there in the end but it was really yeah. until uh, the very last minute that we got all the pieces of the film together we could see finally see the vision we had had in our heads for for four years yeah so it was a big relief this spring <laughs> I can yeah, we we, we, uh, we we knew from, from the start that this we we don't want too much dialogue we want to make sound and music one of the main characters of this film and, yeah. and let it have its space so so that also uh, requires um, uh, our ourselves and our team to be very brave and, and we have had the best of, of help uh, creating this world of sound yeah was it was it a big team your, your team for making this movie did you work with a lot of different people to Get where you wanted to go, or I think it was quite quite a normal team, but, yeah. Yeah. but for a long time. Yeah, it took a long time to yeah. do it. Yeah. We uh, uh, we spent uh, uh, one year, not in total, but uh, during one year, we, we gathered the drummers uh, and uh, and just went on a hunt for sounds. Yeah, pretty much like as it is in the movie. Yeah. you go out yeah. and try to find the right sounds. Yeah. So um, that was. Um, in the end, we got uh, over 23,000 sound files that the composer Magnus Bjørnson put together to music. Yeah, so he, he almost went bananas <laughs> from that. <laughs> I can't imagine the amount of sound hard files. Drives, hard drives, hard yeah, yeah, drives, hard yes. drives, full of sound. Yeah. yeah, and then you, yeah, you have to choose the right one, choose the right. But yes. it's, yeah, but it's a difficult you know, process. The, the nice thing is that it's really a mix between the, the, the you know, high tech and low tech finest uh, microphones and, and sometimes we just re record with iPhone and, and yeah so that, that's there are so many ways to do this and and the the concept in, in itself doesn't have to be uh, something very uh, exclusive and technically uh, uh, complicated the, the 
the idea is that anyone can really do this, more or less. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be done in a certain way or yeah. a certain technique. Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, we're really challenging people to do this. It's like you have to do these, 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 these groups like Stomp and whatever, they, yeah. they, they use different yeah, stuff as well to create yeah. noise and create... I, I, I thought it was kind of like... A, a combination of uh, Disney's Fantasia with the work that Cult that, uh, puts out because they have this this organic approach as well and mm -hmm. use sound to make rhythm and whatever. Mm. And it was so but there's one big difference between us and Stomp, and it's that we don't dance. Yeah, <laughs> but musicians it's, it's kind never of dance. <clears throat> Drummers never dance. Yeah, but if you if you see all those well, like like the, the machines at the Opera House. There's kind of a dance. That's there. A, that's a little ballet. Yes, yeah. it is. Well, it's, it, it's it's more an, maybe more of, a, of an accident. They just have <laughs> okay. to stand like, like this to, yeah. to see the yeah yeah, yeah sure yes. yeah yeah. Perhaps you can take it to a next level in the sequel and uh, we'll see. About that. <laughs> the sequel? Are you talking about the sequel? Well, I think people would like it. I would like it. Sound of noise too. I will just take a deep breath and then yeah. get to it. Yes, <laughs> but there there are plans to to. Um, Get this on stage or, or do something musical. Yes, yes, and that's that's really uh, uh, fun. Yeah. yeah, I'm looking forward to, to doing that. And we're so we're developing a, a, like a live six drummers live. Yeah, uh, where we will uh, blend both live drumming with real drums, yeah. like power, and then also uh, remix of, of this music and new music and sounds, uh, and uh, also video projections. Yeah, so it's really multimedia. Happening. It's an art experience. Yes, and that's uh, that's what, how we want to yes. see it. It's something you put on the poster. An art, art experience. Yes. Will people come then? Uh, if they've seen the film, I think they will. Yes. Think. And, and certainly here, I think we're open for a lot of stuff. So. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. You must have noticed that, that uh, the reaction. Oh, it was a wonderful was, was uh, audience. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, a great, great screening. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Everywhere we go, it's it's really. Warms us really because it's so such a good response, yeah, and, and, and you never know that. Well, you work with this for years, and you we sit in, in, in our little room and and try to figure out what what's, what we want to do, and and, yeah. and you can just you know cross your fingers that this is something that somebody else understands. Yeah, because we follow our hearts, we do whatever we find interesting, and uh, now it's like a real gift that people enjoy it. It's yeah, really nice. it's been the talk of the, the festival, and even I don't know. Um, so there's the, the the public prize, which is mm, yeah. what people could vote for. <clears throat> and the last thing that there's been um, um, reports, um, like yesterday and today, and before the final report will be uh, <coughs> announced, and it's up there, you know. Let's, let's hope for a audience. That will you don't believe in it. I've heard that too. Yeah. But I have no comment <laughs> yet. Thank you for talking to us. <laughs> Thank you. And the best of luck with the movie. And yeah, we'll see, um, hopefully, we'll see a lot of people seeing it here in Belgium as well. Because yeah. it's released, right? Yeah, in it's February. In February. Yeah. Yeah. So people have to wait a long time. Yeah. But it's worth it. Thank you. Thanks.